opening multiple plugin windows. So when you're in Pro Tools, you have a plugin window open, and then you go to select another plugin. Uh, well, now it's changed. I wanted, I wanted to see both of these. Well, how would I do that? That's uh, very simple. Over here, you'll notice this this red button. If you hover over it, it'll say Target button. If you want to have multiple plugin windows open at the same time, just deselect that button. You see, it's grayed out now. So now, when I go over here and select this other EQ one. There it is. Now we have two open. So now I want to open up another one. Ah, well now it's changed because we didn't deselect the target button. Take that off. And there we go. Deselect this one. Open up 11. Deselect this one. Open up another EQ. There we go. Now we have several plugins on screen. All at the same time. This works the same way with your sends. Open up this send here. You'll see the target button. If I go to open up this bus. Ah, well see it replaced it. So we deselect that and then there we go now we have both of them on screen another thing you could do so we'll actually turn this target on is when you're opening another plugin hold down the shift key when you click the insert so we'll hold down shift and we click the insert now we've we have released shift go to our plugins here grab a plugin here and there it opened up and it was already deselected by default so there's a quick little trick you can do when opening a plugin when you know you want the target button to be off so we'll do that again Hold down shift, click one of the inserts. We have release shift at this point. Grab another plug in here, and there it is, already deselected. So that's how you would have multiple plugins on screen by deselecting this target button on the plugins you want to stay open. And on the plugins you want to replace, you can leave the target button on, you'll open up another plugin, and it'll replace it on screen.